reporting for Katie Chats here at the Hamilton Film Festival in downtown Hamilton with Juliana and Stu, who are both a part of the film First We Take Hamilton. How did you get involved in this project? I've, I've always wanted to be in one of Eve's films. Um, I've, I've really just wanted to be in it, and I kept saying that uh, I, I want to be in your, uh, one of your films because he's made uh, many, and they've been all been really like uh, artistic and very experimental, and I really thought that was like really awesome, and I wanted to really be a part of it, and uh, he really put me in there. Oh, well, I, I've known Eve since high school, and I, I've been involved in pretty well all his movies, so I got a little part in this one, you know, so. And tell me a little bit about your characters. Well, I, I play the uh, the bartender in the uh, the bar scenes. There's, there's a lot of uh, music in this movie, and it takes place, the, most of the music is in this bar, and I'm, I'm the bartender, that's basically it. <laughs> Uh, the part that I play is the mystic, and uh, it's very uh, a, a part that Eve's really like he he gave to me really nicely, and uh, he just let me be myself, and and it was a lot of fun. It was a lot of fun. Great, and you contributed some of the music to the film as well. What style of music do you play? I play like a, a sixty string folk harp called the bandura, and it was a uh, very uh, very raw. Um, the, the way that we played it. Um, a lot of the scenes uh, were shot like uh, on really rainy or windy days and uh, I played the music at, and I played and I gave some samples and um, I, I feel like it, it helped to make the mood of the film. Great. And how do you expect audiences to respond to this movie? <clears throat> well, I think because, because this movie is uh, kind of multi-layered, and involves a lot of symbolism. I think it's a matter of each individual viewer can see it and, and make their own uh, determinations about it. Uh, there's one thing that Eves insists on in his movie is the, the viewer's freedom not to be led by the hand, but to make their own conclusions. I feel people are gonna love it because it's very, it's very different and very, 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 very different from anything they've ever seen. And where is the best place to find out more information on you as performers and on the film online? Oh, sorry, I, I didn't hear the question. Well, you can find out more information about the film, but uh, well, th information about my music, um, you can contact me. Find me on Facebook with Juliana Lachance, that's my name. And uh, for the film, you can, uh, how do we contact Eves? Yeah, yeah. How do we, how do we contact him? What's it? Oh, uh, I guess Eves on, on, on Facebook. Facebook. Yeah. Eves. <laughs> I just, I wanted to mention that other, besides Juliana's music, uh, there's also music by local bands, there's Swords of Texas and Chelsea Kreitz also provided for this one. Well, well, I can't wait to see the film and hear all of the music. Thank you so much to both of you. Congratulations and enjoy the festival. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I'm Katie Ullman reporting for Katie Chats here at the Hamilton Film Festival in downtown Hamilton.